everyone. This is Lizette from the Free J. Just want to share with you a little about resting in God. There's a lot of people out there that are not resting in the Lord. I think about it all the time. Always seeking for peace and rest. Always looking for some kind of rest in my, my mind and in my spirit. And how I did that was repenting every day seeking a life of repentance, going to my knees, asking God to forgive me daily, every day, waking up in the middle of the night, just wanting to be good at all times, wanting to be pleasing to the Lord. And what I know now is that I'm resting in God, knowing that He's forgiven me of all my sins, past, present, and future. And I realize that even I can't give that to you, that understanding in that peace and that rest. Only God can. And there is a God out there. And He has given you peace. And He has given you a life of resting and knowing that you don't have to perform works or anything like that, to receive this rest, to receive this peace in your mind and in your heart. And how you receive that will be between you and Him. And how you will know that you have rest will be between you and Him. I can't tell you how I can give you that personal relationship between you and God. But I just wanted to share how you can have that peace. You can have that rest in knowing that God's not mad at you. He's not there to point the finger at you say how bad you are and how you're not this and that. He's love. And if you're out there today and maybe you don't even believe in God and you don't believe in there's a God and maybe you're thinking, well, why does God let all these bad things happen and things like that? For me, I don't believe that God allows those things to happen. It's a fallen world, and we allow those things to happen. But I still can't give you an answer for that either. That comes with a relationship between you and God. He's a person. He's an individual. And he's waiting for you to talk with him right where you are at. Allow him to give you rest and peace today. In Jesus' name.